Yo, what is up, my familia? My name is Isaac, and welcome to Five Nights of Freddy. This game was recommended to me by one of our fellow community members, and I'm gonna go ahead and put their name here on the screen. Hey, how's it going, man? Thank you for the recommendation. Alright, so I have heard and seen a little bit of this game a long time ago, but I never really quite fully understood what the game was about. I think just the basic premise is to survive a certain amount of nights while these robotic animatronic monsters, I don't know why I just described two different ways of saying robots, <laughs> how, to, how to survive these animatronic uh, robots, animatronics that come to life. And that's it. I don't really know anything. I'm basically going to be learning as you guys watch. So please be patient with me. I will try to learn as fast as I can so I can, you know, play the game as it's supposed to be played. So... Yeah. <laughs> also, if you guys like the video, please make sure to hit that like button. And if you guys want to support the channel, you know what to do. Please make sure to hit that red rectangular subscribe button. I am trying to reach 50 subscribers. So if you guys like the content, you want to see more, you want to support the channel, I would greatly appreciate it if you guys could hit that subscribe button. All right, guys, but enough of that. Let's go ahead and play. Also, I want to apologize for the resolution. Uh, there's no settings for this game to be changed uh, to 1920 1080p. So I kind of had to adjust my OBS, and I don't know if it's perfectly centered, so I apologize if it's not perfectly centered. <laughs> All right, <laughs> enough of that. Let's go. New game. All right, guys, here we go. It says 12 a.m. first night. Okay, so I, I think we only use our mouse for this game, right? I don't think we use the keyboard. It's just kind of like mouse-based. Here we are. All right. Seems like we're at the office. Chilling. Okay. Seems like we're getting a phone call. Do we have to press on the phone to answer the caller? I don't see the phone. Okay. All right. I guess we're going to let it ring. Okay. Hello? There we go. We answered. Hello? I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact. So, I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to tell you there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll be fine. Right, so right. There's nothing to worry about. Famous last time. words right there. Okay. Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company. Oh, the introduction. Talk. Oh, uh, uh, this is boring. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun come to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to property or person. Uh, Upon discovering the damage or death have occurred, a missing person... I'm sorry, the, what, the, the death have occurred, they're not responsible for what? ...property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached, and the carpets have been replaced, blah blah blah. Now, that might sound bad, I know, but there's really nothing Yeah, it sounds about. pretty bad, what do you mean? You guys uh, are responsible for my, if I die? Do get is that a what they said? At night, but do I blame them? No. If I were forced to sing... So we're not gonna get health insurance. That sucks. For years, I never got a bath. I'd probably be a bit irritable at night, too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children, and we need to show them a little respect. Right? Okay. So just be aware... They can respectfully the get the frick away from my office, or they're gonna get decked in the face. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servos locking up, they get turned off for too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too. But then there was the bite of 87. Yeah, it's amazing that the human body can live without the frontal lobe, you know? The, uh, now, the, sorry, the bite of what? The only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. What? Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, They'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Uh, why? Um, now I don't like to be so forcefully be put into do stuff forcefully. I don't like that. I don't like to be forcefully be done. Do no. Devices, especially around the facial area. So you can imagine how having your head forcefully pressed inside one of those could cause a bit of discomfort and death. Uh, the only parts of you that would likely see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth. 
pop out the front of the mask. Oh, um, so, okay, all right, yeah. Yeah, they don't tell you these things when you sign Yeah, up. this would have been really but good, hey, useful information at the job interview. Okay, I'll tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras, and remember to close the doors only if absolutely necessary. Gotta conserve power. All right, good night. I, it kind of sucks that, I mean, I guess it's just to make the game a little bit more challenging, but I've been noticing that the power energy has been dropping, and we haven't really done anything. So, I guess it's like... Is there a way for us to reserve the energy, or do we have to kind of just deal with it? Uh, just, uh, just dropping, uh, you know, the energy dropping. Okay, seems like they're all right there. It's just chilling. Let's look around here. Sorry, out of order. Pirate Cove. What is that? Okay. All right. It's uh, two o'clock in the morning. Nothing's happened so far. Pretty good. Pretty good. Let's check them cameras again. Oh, hey, <laughs> one of them moved. Where is he? Hi! How's it going there? That you don't belong there. You're supposed to be over here with your friends. Okay, he's still there. Okay, those are still there. Okay, cool. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. As long as they keep a distance and they don't get near me. Still there. Okay, I think the first night is going to be kind of chill. You know, I don't think anything is going to happen. They're just kind of showing us the them moving and whatnot. So, I think we can have a pretty chill first day. You know, just lay back, relax, maybe turn on some TV. Eat my burger here that I purchased. Get that sodi pop going. Uh, okay, the other one's gone. Oh, oh, it's right here. Okay, okay. Okay, alright. We're fine, we're fine. We got three more hours, we should be fine. It seems like once you start using the camera too much, it starts to fade into static, right? Uh... Oh, there he is! Hi! <laughs> How's it going there? Oh, we left 25%, nice. So... Uh, us just closing the door is gonna stop them from, like, coming in, right? Okay, one more hour, one more hour, we're fine. Uh... Oh, it's right here, it's right here, right here. Okay, he's gone. Oh, he went back over here. Okay, we'll, we'll be fine. We got one hour left. I have 9%. Oh my god, this is not good. Oh. Nice. First night, no problem. Let's go! Okay, here we go. Second night. Alright, so it's not- it's really not that hard. The one thing that I do need to better do is manage my, uh... The, the uh, the power. Okay, we're getting another call. Alright. Uh... Hello? Oh, wow, they, they moved already. Sure oh, <laughs> they working fast uh, right now. Interestingly enough, Freddy himself doesn't come on stage very often. I've uh, heard he becomes a lot more active in the dark, though. So, hey, I guess that's one more reason not to run out of power, right? Uh, I also want to emphasize the importance of using your door lights. Uh, there are blind spots in your camera view, and those blind spots have to be right outside your doors. So if, if you can't find something, or someone, on your cameras, uh, be sure to check the cool, door blind spots. Uh, you might yeah. have to have a few seconds to react. Uh, Where's the other guy? Any danger, of course. Uh, I'm not implying that. Uh, You're also, definitely implying that we're in danger. What do you mean? You're telling me this information? about killer robots trying to kill us and you're telling us that there's there's freaking blind spots for us to okay yeah i guess he doesn't like being watched i don't know but anyway i'm sure you have everything under control uh talk to you soon oh hi you're right here or very close
he is right next to us. We're gonna close the door. He's right there. I don't. I don't. I don't think I sh should keep that door open. I mean, have it open. Okay. Does having the door closed make it uh, waste more battery? Oh, he moved. Oh, cool. Um, all right. All right, this is, this, is, this is another fine night. We're gonna do this. Check this out, guys. Check this out. Freddy hasn't moved. The chicken person hasn't moved, or whatever the heck it is. Oh, that's super cool. I can't... Okay, he's right here. He's uh, down up the hall. Okay, let's be a little bit more conservative with uh, with the camera and the doors and the lights. Because we're at 66%. Okay, seems like he's still up the hall. No, never mind. Closed! <laughs> Get the freaking door slammed on your face, bitch! Alright, we're doing fine. Look at this. We are professional. There you are. You are. You are. All the way over there. Keep that distance, please. Get the door slammed on you, bitch. Later. He's still there. Okay, the chicken's still there, looking at us very creepily. Are you gone? You're gone. There we go. All right, it's 3 a.m. We got two more hours. We got two more hours. We got this. Oh, no. Okay. Looks like Freddy moved a little bit. Never mind, he didn't. The hell is that? I'm sorry, what is this thing? I don't know, and I don't want to find out. <laughs> Alright, just two more hours, two more hours. We got 38% of, uh, of, uh, of battery here. So let's be a little bit more conservative with the camera use. You're still there. Where's the chicken? <laughs> okay, that... <laughs> that got me kind of good. Um, but I want to go again. And we're just going to continue. We're not going to do, you know, all that. One and two. We're just going to go straight back into night two. That, that got me pretty good. He is fast. That blue bear guy... He's pretty fast. He was... He's, he moves really fast. Okay. Alright, here we go. Another day at the office here, just chilling. Trying to avoid animatronic, deadly, freaking... Animatronics trying to kill us. Oh, one of them moved already. That blue bear, he's fast. He's right here, okay. 1B. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, let's just chill. Let's just chill. He's pretty fast, though. I, I, he, I think he's gonna be the one that we gotta watch out for. Cause he's fast as frick. Still there. They're still there. Okay, let's take that away from there. Let's just chill. Okay, he is gone. He is gone. He is. He is fast. <laughs> he is really fast. Okay. Oh, he's like literally right here. Close the door. Get the door slammed on you, bitch. Get out of here. You gone? Nope, you're still there. Okay, the chicken robot lady is in uh, the party room. You're still there. Okay. Mm hmm. Okay, she's still. Well, let me see where. Uh, 
you know, Freddy hasn't moved in all this time that we've been here. You're still there? Ooh, another way that I actually I can notice if they're there or not is this. The reflection. He's gone now. Uh, the chicken lady. Okay, I think the blue bear guy is right here. He moved back a little bit. Man, can we put like a YouTube video in the background or something, you know? Like, to kind of just chill. He's gone. He's right there. Chicken lady's there. Blue bear's guy right there. Freddy hasn't moved. I think he just slightly moved a little bit closer to the... To the camera. Maybe he wants to say hi to us? Never mind. It's 3 a.m. We got 44%. This is looking pretty good. Hopefully. Let's look at the pirate cove here. Because that opened up last time. And, uh... Gotta make sure we're good. Gotta make sure we're good. Okay, here we go. Let's go. I don't know why he clapped and said, let's go. Why, why is that gone? Okay, he went back. Close the door. Let's see if he's still there. Yep, he's still there. Oh, robot chicken lady. I didn't really quite understand about the blind spots. He's still there. Still there. One more hour, one more hour. 27%. We're looking good. This is looking pretty good. He's gone. Oh, uh, okay, the chicken lady went back over there. Where's the blue bear? Uh, blue bear, I don't like that. Where is he? I don't trust him. I'm gonna close that door. I mean, we have 19%. We should be fine. Oh, there he is. Okay, so let's uh, open it. Where's the chicken lady? Okay, she's chilling over there in the party room. Yeah, having a good time. Oh my god, come on! Alright guys, well this is where I'm gonna stop. Um, I don't know if you guys wanna see more or not. If I'm gonna be perfectly honest with you guys, I typically don't play these types of games just because I'm more of a person who likes to play those games where you go out and explore a map and, and you know, you know have experiences and stuff like that i'm not one to play these types of games not that there's anything wrong with them but it's not you know i just it isn't something that i would typically play to so, it, this isn't something i would typically choose to play but i gotta admit it was quite fun that second night was kind of a challenge and you guys are probably thinking really the second night was a challenge it's my first time all right guys cut me some slack this is my first time playing it so it was a little bit challenging for me but I'm pretty sure if I like played it a little bit more, I would, you know, kind of get a understanding of how to, you know, just play better. But uh, I don't know if you guys want to see more, let me know. I would be down to play it. Uh, again, this was a, this was quite fun, so I'm down. All right, guys. Well, I do want to say thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed it, please make sure to hit that like button. And if you guys want to support the channel, you know what to do. Please make sure to hit that red rectangular subscribe button. I am trying to reach 50 subscribers. So if you guys uh, want to support the channel, you like the content, and you want to see more, I would greatly... Whoops, I hit my microphone. <laughs> I would greatly appreciate it if you guys could hit that subscribe button. And again, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for hanging out with me. It really means a lot to me. And thank you so much. All right. I'll see you guys later. Bye.